Happy Sunday to everybody. I guess you guys can say this is my pre-Valentine's Day vlog. Um, basically, I just wanted to come and let everybody know that I'm excited about Valentine's Day. I don't know about you, but those of you who tried to block Valentine's Day out, because I know there are some Valentine's Day haters out there who try to block it out mentally. But guess what? No. <laughs> it's February 14th every year, and this Thursday is February 14th. Um... I'm excited because every year I get the most beautiful Valentines from my babies. They work so hard for like two, three weeks on Valentines for mommy. And so I get excited about that. And it's usually a special day for them. And we usually do something together. But this year they flipped it on me. They're like, oh, mommy, we have plans for Valentine's Day. We're going to a dance. And I'm like, wow, okay guess you're going to a dance so <laughs> this year I will be a chaperone at their elementary school's dance my son's a fifth grader and my daughter's a third grader and I found out last week that my daughter has a valentine she's like <laughs> she came home with this valentine picture and I'm thinking it's for mommy no I hung it on the refrigerator thinking I got me something special she said mommy what happened to my valentine's day present Terrell made me a valentine. I made one for him and he made one for me. And I'm like, she said, oh, you put it on the refrigerator. She said, okay, it can stay. I was like, wait a minute, let's talk. So I had to let her know she can't have a boyfriend. No, no, the only person authorized to have a boyfriend within these walls is mommy. <laughs> so we had that little talk and she's like, I know mommy, I can't date until I'm 16 or 17. And I'm looking at her. Why are you even thinking about that? You're eight. Your job is to go to school. Luckily, my son, he's not talking about any little girls, but he's really quiet. The only thing he requested is that I send roses to his fourth grade teacher, Miss Hardage, which I took care of last week, so she should get her Valentine's Day gift. Uh, let's see. Um, all my friends out there that I know on a personal level, you should be receiving your Valentine's if you haven't already. Some of you guys should have received them on Saturday that live out of town. If you haven't received them, you'll be receiving them this week before Valentine's Day or on Valentine's Day. Some people had special gifts included with theirs for, um, uh, Valentine's Day, but, um, St. Patty's Day is coming up, so I always send out St. Patty's Day cards for those who know me. I'm a card fanatic. I love sending cards, and I love letters and notes and things like that. That's just who I am. Um, I don't do the email thing unless I have to. I hate text messaging, Shan. So, so those of you who know me know me best, then you appreciate me for who I am. Um, but I just want to let everybody know Valentine's Day it, it's I mean it is once a year yeah 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 but you should show the people that you appreciate and that make a difference in your life just how much you love them on a regular basis versus just one day out of the year that's just like Christmas Christmas should be every day to me anyway and the people that matter the most to me that inspire me that to to be all I can be and I show them on a regular basis just how much I care about them and love them. And those people that are important in my life right now, they know that because I haven't, uh, I have taken the time to let them know just how much I appreciate them being a part of my life. And I think that everybody should do that on a regular basis. So if you're not, if you haven't told somebody you love them, you care about them, and you do want them to know just how much you love them and you care about them, do it. Um, it Valentine's Day is Thursday, but like all week, just take the time this week. To, if you see somebody that's not, they're feeling a little down, try to perk them up. You know, I know everybody that goes through their little struggles. Trust me, my life is a beautiful struggle. Um, but, you know, try to think positive and be a positive influence on everyone that you come in contact with just make sure that you let everybody know this week and eh, well just try to do it every day please for me make an attempt not asking for promises just try uh, <laughs> to let those people who matter most know just how much you care about them and if you feel like hey Valentine's Day is just one day a year you know hey it is show them on Valentine's Day just how much you care about them and love them and appreciate them so 
I guess that's enough rambling for me today. I will blog again before the end of the week. Actually, I may just wait until Friday so I can follow up with what happened at the dance with my little nutty buddies, which I'm excited about being a chaperone for. <laughs> um, but I got a week off coming up, and I'm I'm excited about that because I don't have to. I won't have any kids. <laughs> but um, I'll catch you guys later. Thanks for taking the time to listen to my blog. And um, for those of you who are important to me, and everybody who's important to me know that they're important to me, I love you guys, I care about you, and I think the world of you. You are appreciated. Have a great Sunday night. I have to go in and pretend like I want to work. Talk to you guys soon. Bye.